Okay, let's continue our squat series now. So you should have had a look and done the test, the overhead squat test, to see if your arms travel forward, so from a straight position, if your calves came off the ground during the squat, or if your knees buckled in or out, then you need some work correcting that squat, especially before you add weights. It's one of the most important things I see people in the gym all the time doing their squats and they load it up and they're like, rrr, rrr. it's a back breaker ready to happen. So start with the basics, clean up the squat pattern, but you need to do it according to where you're at. So for those whose knees are buckling in, coming out, and you're working on the squat pattern, perhaps the wall squat. For those who are now having troubles with the back of the legs getting down, I'm going to show you an exercise to start working on that to get that squat down. What I get you to do is work with some bench. So here I've got a little stool. So it could be a chair, it could be a bench, some height. And what you want to do is you want to bring your hands out in front and make a nice L shape. Get your foot positioning right. So for me, I'm going to have my feet shoulder width apart. So I'm pushing my bum out and then I'm going to come down. And then I'll adjust it. So I'm a bit close there. So from here, I come down, I rise up. Again, down, rise up. Now you should feel a nice stretch with the hamstrings. You're coming from here, down into the deep squat. You're using this position to help you. Watch out for really rounding. So try to keep the back as straight as you can. But you're using this block or bench to assist you moving up and down, so up here, moving down, nice line, moving up. So that's especially for the guys with the really short um, hamstrings, calves, so that's back, superficial back line, to get you down moving into that deep squat. The other possibility is to use this along with a towel. So you could use your little stool to start, and I'm gonna be behind you now, but from here, I'll do it on an angle. So here's my towel. I'm using it to go down and come up. So I'm using that little bit of assistance. Um, so you want to modify the squat according to, like I said, where you're at. We're going to move on to other versions of the squat. But if you're having troubles with getting the bum to the ground, try that out. See how you go.